there any of the men out there that watch my channel, I thought you guys might be interested in this. It's $550. It's a small, small pump. There's a magnificent large Pepsi sign behind here too. $430. That lights up. We have some uh, standard polarine motor oil gasoline for $650 for this vintage sign. And some motor oil. Those are $20. And I can't read the other one, but I think it's probably around the same price, too. And we have a five quart liquid filled to error point. Not seen one of these before. And I don't know the price. I don't see a price on it. That's neat. There's a backrest for a Harley motorcycle, 65. Okay. You know how I love I these? I I 55, 45, 45, and 55. Aren't they wonderful? They're, they're a decent size. Look, guys. husband would like him, that's for sure. I hate to even see how much he is. Yeah, it's about a thousand dollars. We just pop them on Cassidy fabric. The cute old games. And there's Ferdinand. Isn't he neat? We got some ducks. Look at that. And $22. Sugar Skull. This is very pretty. I like this. It's very delicate looking. And the shell made into a fish. I'm telling you guys, if you've never been here, you may want to make a trip next year because a lot of the things I don't run across, you know, out in the wild around my area, I'm finding here at pretty good prices. I know this is super Victorian. Okay. See now, where else could you find a turtle light? Well, besides my shop, I already sold one. <laughs> We're here and show you some. Looks like we've got Frankie for 80. And Dracula for 90. They have lots of Christmas. It looks like there's a shortage of Halloween. We have these guys right here. They're running $40 a piece. And they're definitely all vintage pieces. We have the witch over here. Isn't she neat? She's 75. <laughs> oh, and I didn't see him. Right there. 
He's fabulous. It is. The camel's on the leather. And look at the head. Look at him. <laughs> oh, is it crazy or not? There's two of them. And $90 for the pair. And they look like blow mold. One of them looks like it's been painted. The other one looks like it's in its natural state. You guys, this. And this right here. Look to the right there on this piece. It is gorgeous. It's $225. Isn't that fabulous? All the detailing. These are lovely. I like how they're the back of them is is flush, and then they're rounded in the front, and they feel like they're cast iron. They're heavy. I spy some excellent candelabras. Look at those. They are gorgeous. Yes. Look at the price tag. I'm sure they're worth every penny. Look at him. I'm in love with him. I should have married a millionaire. Then, maybe, <laughs> maybe I could get all these lovelies. We need to walk around the other way because I see some things that I definitely am interested in. Hopefully I'm not jiggling the camera too much here. <clears throat> Got lots of interesting lovelies over here. Look. <laughs> How I find bugs, or bugs find me, let's say. Isn't that interesting? Globes, I always like globes. There's an old seltzer bottle. I like those two for some reason. 65. Moore Brothers Bottling Company, Toledo, Ohio. Then we have some, okay. looks like some surgical instruments. Possibly dental, yep, definitely dental instruments. Look what we got here. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's a scalpel. And there's another one. My lord. Oh, 
here's some old packages of chalk. I'm shadowing my own filming here. I'm sorry, guys. Isn't that interesting? Lots of old keys. Oh, so these are okay. Yeah. There's a ferrous sulfate bottle. That's right up my alley. Let's see what we have in here. Ooh. Old stamps. Mm-hmm. Ulrich Piano Co. Sign and price marker. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Hundred dollars. I don't know how well this is coming off to you guys. If you'll bring your cards that you've taken by mistake. One twenty-five. It's a practice bomb. And over here. <clears throat> <clears throat> I thought it looked like <clears throat> a piece of medieval equipment, but it says it's a well point. I guess maybe when they're drilling and digging for a well. Isn't that neat? And this looks like a torture device, too. It said it's a flat, flax hetchel. Flax hetchel for $50. Isn't that interesting? Look at these guys. I've never seen them on a post before. Isn't that neat? These blow molds are $48 a piece. Isn't that neat? Look at the warty pumpkin. This bench somebody's made. It's fantastic. It's got hooks on the top. We've got a mixture of old and it looks like a few new pieces. It's a giant fish if you want a giant fish. Ooh, look at all that. 275. Look at all that. Stop on red signal. That's an awesome piece. I don't know if you can notice from the distance. Love that. These caged pillars are neat too. Got, I've never seen anything like it. It's $120. Oh, and we see a chest. That one's beautiful. Some little pedal cars, push cars. Firefighter. Okay. We're going to go find George the Antique Nomad in this mess here.